A hunger-striking detainee at the Guantanamo Bay detention facility will again be subjected to force feeding. Here, a shackled detainee is led into a medical room and restrained in a chair. A nurse lubricates a long, flexible nasogastric tube. The tube is inserted into the detainee's nostril and pushed down the back of the throat, past the esophagus and into the stomach. A nutritionally dense, over-the-counter liquid meal supplement is then slowly forced into the stomach via a syringe. When the feeding is complete, the tube is removed. The process can take up to two hours. Repeated force feeding may result in complications including skin irritation and infection. Some prisoners have described the practice as a form of torture.